Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to the channel. I hope everybody had a very happy 4th of July. And sorry for no upload last night or the couple days before 4th of July. The weather was extremely hot and it was hard to get outside and really do anything. But anyways, I hope everybody did have a happy 4th. And today, we're going to be going out to Revzilla in Philly along with Crossroads Motorsports because they are the only zero motorcycle dealer in the area here near Harris anywhere near Harrisburg so we're gonna go check out some zero motorcycles which if you don't know about zeros they are all electric motorcycles we're gonna go check out the future of motorcycle riding all right guys let's head to Philly Well, that was a fun little trip to Revzilla. So we're gonna leave here and head to, what is it, Cro Crossroads Motorsports, but this is the Revzilla Philly showroom. Be sure to check these guys out online. Revzilla has a lot of merchandise from motorcycle parts to full riding gear, anything you guys need. And they're a great group of folks that do it. So be sure to check them out. All right, so what we have here is the Zero SR, which I'm trying to get a video in because somebody just traded this FXS in on this SR. So these electric bikes are actually becoming very popular. They said they sell surprisingly fast, but this one here is equipped with the 14.4 battery or motor. And from what I got to hear from the guy that traded that one in is these things have like instant torque. They said... They don't have a super big top end, but man, they have the power to get you there. This one has more of a top end though because it's tuned for more highway use. That's more for around the city and having fun on the trails. But these things, we were hoping for a test drive, but unfortunately, since this one is being picked up today, we cannot test drive any of them until every all the paperwork is finalized and we don't have the time to hang around. But anyway, the Zero, the Zero SRs, have a dual battery pack on these so they do hold a charge for pretty good i believe these are rated for 180 miles as is you can get the larger battery pack a quick charger which i think puts these things to charge from empty to full 
in about two hours with a quick charge. If you don't have the quick charge, it's about eight to 10, depending on amperage at your house. But as you can see, these bikes are standard belt driven. They are automatic. Just yank the throttle and go. So, but these bikes are very nice. I didn't personally look into one, but I just can't push myself to spend the 16K tag. But anyway, they're very nice bikes, very nice ride position, and these are the future of motorcycle riding. As long as they can get the battery packs to have a longer range for me, I'd get one since I drive about 110 miles a day to work. But other than that, these bikes are great and I hope I can get a test ride on one soon. And who knows, maybe we'll test ride that one if that stays here long enough. <laughs> So we are going to wrap it up here at Crossroad Power Sports. These guys have a huge variety of bikes, Yamaha, Kawasaki, Honda, and Suzuki. And they also have these infamous Zero electric bikes. So I really do hope you guys like this video. If you do, give it a thumbs up. As always, don't forget to subscribe. And be sure to drop in the comments if you have any questions on any of the bikes or any of the things that we've looked at here today. And be sure to check out all the spots that we stopped, the Philly showroom for Revzilla, Crossroad Motorsports, or Power Sports, I mean. And be sure to check all these guys out. Great companies, and you can find all of your next riding equipment, whether it's a new motorcycle or riding gear at both of these places. Their, their info will be in the description down below. All right, guys, see ya.